I lost 22 pounds on Ozempic. That means I'm obese. The, B, the BMI here in the West. We all have ADHD. Now we forgot what we said. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For this video, I'm gonna be doing a little experiment for myself really and obviously for you guys for YouTube to be sober for 30 days. Completely sober. Just going through the video, I just want to add a couple things in so you guys understand what in the freaking hell is going on. This is starting out with literally all I wanted to do was do 30 days sober. No alcohol, no nothing, right? Didn't lose weight with that. I was like, girl, what the f is going on? So that's when Bernice from Beyond IV Therapy started talking about her sale with her skinny shots, basically semaglutide and B12 injection, right? I cannot believe I look like that. It's absolutely ridiculous. Apparently having one glass of wine every night to wind down isn't considered alcoholism. Everyone has their own opinion, but this is from professionals. This is what my doctors told me, my therapist, so I never really had a thing for alcohol, like a dependence. It really started when my relationship well, my marriage went super downhill and I was finding out more and more stuff, you know, doing all this stuff, having 50,000 secret phones and it really brought down my confidence and like, you know, you start thinking like, damn, what's wrong with me? <laughs> like, why am I not enough? Then Ella came from Ukraine, right? So then it got worse. It just got to a certain extent that I felt like, why am I not just dealing with my feelings? Why am I running away from them? I want to teach myself to be strong, strong, not run away from my problems. I didn't want to teach my kids that either so I decided on Monday to go sober for 30 days and honestly the first day was it was low-key hard <laughs> I'm really enjoying not drinking and it saved so much money and just so many benefits I mean I was just reading about what happens to your body when you stop drinking alcohol like obviously not for like a day you know for like a longer period of time I just feel the need to really do this 30 days and I want to do it on camera we're gonna see if my weight changes guys I gained 25 pounds in the past year you read everywhere that when it comes to losing weight one of the big factors is don't drink alcohol or cut down on your alcohol a lot I really want to do this though and I really want to get my priorities straight this is day three I started Monday now I just don't want to let me read to you guys the different things that happens when you stop drinking because that's an extra like it's a huge health benefit so so let's get into it. Wow, alcohol plays a role in at least half of all serious trauma injuries and deaths from burns, drownings, and homicides. It's also involved in four out of 10 fatal falls and traffic crashes, as well as suicides. Your heart gets healthier. It says it's true that the regular glass of wine at night is good for your heart, but it's not good when you do more than one drink. Cutting back on drinking or stopping is gonna lower your blood pressure, levels of fat, and chances of heart failure. Well, my big thing is the levels of fat called triglycerides. I don't know what that is. Your liver may heal. Your relationships may improve. Giving up drinking may ease any depression and anxiety and elevate your self-esteem. Crazy. Lower cancer risks. You'll sleep better. That's true. Over time, large amounts of alcohol blunt your immune system and your body's ability to repair itself. Alcohol dependence can make it harder to think or remember things. Let me show you guys what I look like now. Also, I got this new scale and it measures like everything, body weight, skeletal mass, everything, visceral fat, and it tells you your age or whatever based on your body composition. It says I'm aged like 36 and I'm 29. That's sad. Okay, let me show you the scale. Let me show you how I look. This thing was only like $20. Highly recommend. And it pairs with the app. This is how much I weigh, guys. This is crazy. Look at this. You see that? That's crazy. Let me show you guys what I look like now. This is so embarrassing, but whatever. We're gonna do before and after. This is just proof that anyone can look good on Instagram, but YouTube is where it's at because you can't hide. Oh my god, like a month.
month ago or something by accident we posted a video that was supposed to be just saved to tiktok do you know what was in that oh my god i'm just gonna show snippets of it because it's so embarrassing flashback <laughs> <laughs> End of flashback. We're back at Beyond IV Therapy. Good God. Melania, wait. <laughs> So this is future Marta. Just with losing weight again and everything, you feel so much more confident. Like, I would not wear something like this at the weight I was in the beginning. I was literally 20 pounds heavier. Even though I lost weight, I still feel like we could use a boost. And I just want to do this unboxing with you guys because... I've heard about Boomba for literally as long as I've had TikTok probably. I really want to do this unboxing with you guys because I feel like this video is all about confidence. Boomba works best with something that already has a structure to it, you know, so it'll sit in there real nice. Got it in the beige color size C. So this just basically tells you the steps and what outfits it works best with. This right here, yeah that is the dream this is what we strive for this will be our little secret that's cute so pretty right like so put together like i strive my life to be they are what you imagine them to be both sides are sticky A little asmr with this one you can definitely tell the difference this is like two completely different sizes. The cool thing is you could wear this when you're swimming. I mean, that is a huge difference. That's crazy. Okay, let's do the other one. It smells so good. Are you serious? This is crazy. This is wild. And you can't even tell. Like, you can't even tell. That's always what I wanted, that it like shows the outline. This is why, look at that. I'm so excited. See, we don't we don't need surgery, all that stuff to achieve a look that you want. There's shapewear. There's Boomba. Yeah. Do you see the difference? This is like who? What is the difference? What? What? This is crazy. Just to let you guys know, I am not a doctor, professional, or medical, nothing. This is not for educational purposes. This is just what I did, what I decided to do to lose weight. 22 pounds. Hi. <laughs> what are you going to get done? <laughs> Say, I'm perfect. Oh. You're so cute, baby. This is where I get my vitamins from, right? Mm -hmm. So... What happens is there was a shortage with Ozempic. So the yeah. pharmacy started doing the compound because there was a shortage. Wow. Now Ozempic no longer has a shortage and they want to take it away from us. And we're like, no, we just got it. I just want to make sure she gets the right amount. So she's going to get start out with the 0.5. Mm -hmm. Tiny. <laughs> I was so nervous. You ready? Come, Come on. on. Ready? I just want it. Uh, I think okay. the stomach it's is better. Where in stomach? So right here. That, look how much fat. It's not, it's not even fat. Even you hate fat. fat. <laughs> That's so skinny. <laughs> you make the clients think they're going crazy. You ready? No. I have so. I promise. That's it. Sure. That's it. You finish. I'm so fat. You know, I don't feel. See? Not even blood. <laughs> I told you. Yeah, you it's see? mean I'm really so fat because I don't feel. So skinny. <laughs> I'm skinny now? Guys. Yes. <laughs> and two seconds. What are today? It's casual. She said, oh my God, I have so much fat. Me and Ella were looking at this beginning part where we're getting our first semaglutide injection. And we were like, bro, we thought we were looking good. Ella was talking about the V-cut leggings from Victoria's Secret she had on. She's like, I thought I looked good as hell that day. I was like, me too. Oh my God, it's 333. Bro, literally, I'm not kidding you guys. Every time I look at the time, it's 444, 222, Like, bro, what? Are you sweating? <laughs> yes. She's always sweating. <laughs> Every time she gets nervous. I was terrified. You can't, you can't come regular, Ella. You have to come with issues. You ready? Yes. 
Hi. You guys are gonna feel good. This is gonna make you feel good. I, I we went to Niagara Falls a couple weeks ago and Miss Melania, excuse me, I'm gonna put this on your lips. Okay? Alright, wow. we're gonna lean it back a little bit and she feels so special. Oh boy. and you know what you have to tell me lay her back like I'm doing something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. Look at you. Holy this is holy. only for good girls. Okay? Wow. Holy moly. Ooh, Beautiful. She's so scary. <laughs> oh, baby. Hello. Egg belt. <laughs> it is. It's it sure is. Oh, Lord. Can you? Oh, <gasps> sorry. sorry. Please melt my fat away. Soon I will start the Kybella. Oh, uh, wait. I don't know what that is. So Kybella <laughs> is like little. Say, uh-huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Bella is like little injection points that we put either here or double chin oh, oh look <laughs> three yeah, not two want... three what was she asking i'm sorry about lips she ah what what oh, wait, who is... we, we all have adhd now we forgot what we said <laughs> please <laughs> don't faint <laughs> you you. how fast martha's go because her vein is so big Wee. that'll be set look how fast Wee. let's bring her up I was looking at my BMI. What's your BMI? It's 30. It's over 30, 30.5. Probably more. First of all, let me just explain to you that that means I'm obese. The, B, the BMI here in the US. <laughs> I just had the worst gym session probably. I've never thrown up at the gym with the semaglutide injection. This is day three. Oh my God. Usually at the gym, I do an hour of cardio, typically elliptical. I love the elliptical. I could only do 30 minutes on that. And then I could feel that I was really nauseous. And I was like, I feel like if I do strength training, it's gonna be a wrap. Yeah, and this cold sore has been healing for literally two weeks. I really don't feel good. I guess I'll weigh myself just for fun. I literally have one meal a day now, which is good. But like, I realized I can drink a lot of my calories in like liquid and drinks. This is really like embarrassing. I'm considered obese. Yes, now I'm gonna weigh myself. Let's go. Oh my gosh, every time it's 1111. What is that? I use this Renfo app and this thing connects automatically to it. Okay, I'm nervous, but whatever. Oh my god, I lost weight! Um, don't judge the clothes in the back. The dryer broke. I was just doing a TikTok for the Maylies collaboration on TikTok. Did I just say that twice? I have so much Maylies. Hold on, let me show you. So I have Be Glossy. There's so much. <laughs> I can't get control of my kids' hair. They have like Dominican slash Mexican slash Ukrainian hair. I don't know what's gonna work, but listen, I've tried it all and none of it works. Anyways, be thick. I just got this one. This is for outer thigh cellulite. Oh my God, yeah, don't even say anything. <laughs> be tight. Oh my God, there's like just be glowy, be flex, be foxy. Yeah, like I'm slacking because I don't really use them as much as I should, but whatever. So I really wanted to do an update. Today is Thursday. Wait, that doesn't matter. What day is it though? Okay, it's June 8th. So I love watching, I don't know what her name is on TikTok, but I love her. I literally die every time. So after a while, everybody's smoking this shit and they, they getting the munchies. And I'm like, hey man, cause I hate hanging around skinny bitches. Y'all bitches don't get hungry unless y'all smoking like them. So when they <laughs> Even if I'm in the worst mood, I'll watch her TikTok. So I'll be like, okay, I feel much better now. Yesterday, Sophia found a four leaf clover. That's the first time my whole entire life I've ever seen one. And she brought it today to school cause it was show and tell day. Everyone's gonna freak out. Okay, this is my ADHD. Do you see what I'm talking about? Okay. Where I get the semaglutide from is Beyond IV Therapy from Bernice. Absolutely amazing. They're on sale right now from her. So if you're in Connecticut, click the link down below and DM her. She got you with the prices. Just tell her that Marta sent you from YouTube. So I was due to do the shot on Tuesday, but my appetite was still suppressed. And I'm like, let me just 
wait a couple more days to just drag it on a little because I'm cheap as you know. I am planning to stop it when I get to my goal weight because now that I've lost eight pounds, even these days that I didn't do the shot the days I was supposed to, with the lower weight, I feel less of a need to eat and I don't have cravings for worse food. Like I would die for McDonald's, stuff like that and chips and whatever and beer. But now it's more like, I don't know, controlled, like there's no cravings. Right now I weighed myself. Three weeks ago I was 178, now I'm 166. <laughs> this is the week trend. I'll link down below this app, it's called Renfo. It automatically Bluetooth connects to this weight. And as you can see, the weight has just been coming off every day. That's what I like to see, that weight dropping. Every week, I lose about two to three pounds. I remember I did that video a while ago, several years ago, losing 15 pounds in two weeks. It's possible when you drastically change your eating habits, you exercise, but I don't think it's something that will last because you shock your body and then you might just get back to eating habits. I feel like it's better to just slowly get there. Not slowly because I don't like that. I like things like this. Okay, let me show you guys now what I look like. I think I'm gonna do a little side by side. I think that's a huge difference. The back. I'm really proud of myself. I feel like the inches definitely come off faster. But the weight has also come off pretty fast. Overall, I feel so much more confident. And let me just show you how I do the shot, actually. It's already in the video, but I'm like, let me show you how I do it myself. Ew, did you see the light in here? You know what Ella was laughing about? She was like, when I watch your TikToks, usually in the back, all you see, you just see the light hanging and this big hole over here. I'm like, I started dying. I'm like, damn, I didn't even notice that. Okay, so we got them right here. Week three shot. Bernice also said there's B12 in there. It helps because the semaglutide really makes you really exhausted, to be quite honest. The first couple days is not it. <laughs> it's not it at all. I don't know if I mentioned this is the semaglutide 0.5 milligrams. I'm gonna use the alcohol prep pad. My nails are horrendous. Please don't judge me. Listen, I've been going through it. I'll do it right there. If you're scared of needles, just skip forward. Ah, uh, it doesn't hurt. It's just uncomfortable. And that's it. All right, back to regular programming. I'm about to do homework. I'm looking at PhD programs for psychology. I'm really excited. Literally in the first several days, I eat like one big meal a day. Basically like I'll start eating a meal and I can't finish it. Then I'll eat the rest and lunch and then I can't finish it, and then I'll eat the rest in the evening. Drinking a lot of water is really important. Just wanted to do a quick update because I feel horrible. I feel sick to my stomach. Like last night, I felt like my stomach had this weird, it wasn't cramps, it didn't hurt. It was like this weird sensation. It was kind of hard to go to sleep because the feeling was uncomfortable. I feel like I should have done the shot early in the day, like in the morning. I'd rather deal with it in the day than not be able to fall asleep because it feels uncomfortable. My mom made me some eggs, tomatoes, cucumbers, all this stuff. And I took literally one bite and I was like, I'm gonna throw up. The whole time it was like up here. So I was like, you know what? I threw it up. Cause I'm like, I need to get work done. I'm trying to edit this video weekend in my life when I went to court. My lawyer's about to call me in like an hour for an update and I'm pretty sure it's good news because she said in an email that my ex and his lawyer agreed to the settlement agreement. So I guess we can move forward. No one wants to pay 5K for the pre-trial and then the trial, which is 10K retainer, just the minimum. Yeah, we, we, we don't, I'm trying to save money for a Tesla. I'm trying to save money for a Tesla, not for a divorce. Hopefully I feel better tonight, but this is kind of like how the first several days go. I should have done the shot on Tuesday, because now here we are Friday, just did it yesterday, and now I'm like, 
I literally just want to lay in bed and watch Netflix all day. That's how the first two, three days feel for me after doing the shot. So I lost 0.2 pounds since yesterday. If you decide to do what I'm doing to lose the weight you want, just know by Emetrol. It really is quick acting and it takes away all the nausea. This is what I weigh today. So much better than before. I mean... A lot more is green. It doesn't say I'm obese. Mommy, Mommy we sold. No, no way. <laughs> I'll do another update in a couple days. Today is June 20th. I weighed myself today and I was 163 pounds. I am over the moon happy. I'm so, so happy. Just a quick tip, because I know semaglutide can be expensive. If you don't know where to get it from, you know, a professional or a company, or you have to buy it full price, I try to space out the shots a little bit more. If I'm feeling like I'm not hungry, I don't have cravings, I just let it ride. Another tip, you have to make sure that when you do it, the next three days are kind of free that you don't have to go nowhere you're not going out because you're gonna be sick like you're not gonna feel good so we're gonna do shot number i don't know what shot number i can never get used to doing these alcohol prep pad i'm gonna feel like shit today <laughs> and tomorrow and the next day it's worth it though. Today is June 28th. I am 162 pounds. I can't believe it. I'm about to run an errand. I'm gonna go to the police station to get my pistol permit. I just feel like it's important to know how to use it because I had no idea how to before. Anyway, <clears throat> by the way, I found this site, Arctic Peptides. I did a lot of research, read it, and I think I'm gonna mix my own semaglutide. All right. I have one more left and today I'm gonna do this one. So I think I'm gonna just go for an order. Whew, good lord. <laughs> oh my god. If you guys want to know how I reconstitute semaglutide and terzepatide, it's basically the same way. But if you guys are curious, I can definitely give more information on that. Or I could do like a YouTube short, you know what I mean? I canceled my gym membership because I realized what's more important. You really do lose the belly fat and all the extra fat around your body. When you focus on food, nutrition, like they say, abs are made in the kitchen, right? <laughs> Hey guys, so today is October 26th. It's been a while. Busted out the plaid because it's that time of year. I'm so excited for Halloween. I don't know what we're doing, but we're going to do something fun. I wait. Hold on. Let me open the app up because I honestly don't even know. I'm... No freaking way. I weigh 156. So I have 21 pounds to go to hit my goal of 135 pounds. And I still need about 7% less body fat. This is a zillion times better than how it was before. So many things were red or dark orange. And now we're looking pretty healthy, okay? For the most part. It's not perfect. I lost 22 pounds on Ozempic. I cannot believe it. Okay, so let me show you guys. Okay, so first of all, I just want want to throw a little disclaimer I did you guys seen my Timu video I'll pop it up above then you know I got the bang bang okay so one night I gave myself a belly button piercing the other day why I don't know but I don't think my body is liking it right now it looks like it's getting rejected this is what I look like now you see what I mean? Just just don't pay attention to that. Just don't. <laughs> I'll do a little side by side again. It's not my goal weight. I still have 20 pounds to go, but we're going to do a part two. I just really want my waist to get smaller. You see? I don't know, that looks really good. 
I planned to put out this video when I do hit my goal weight, but the thing is, I switched to terzepatide from semaglutide, so I was like, you know what, I'm gonna do a second video on how I lost weight with terzepatide. By the way, semaglutide is basically ozempic and terzepatide is Manjaro, so if you want to look that up, they're similar, but... Everyone says terzepatide works way better. It's much more efficient. It just just does what it's supposed to do. I can't tell you guys enough of how happiness about life went up. My confidence, obviously. I mean, looking back to that first video, bro, I just was editing it this week and I was in complete shock. How did I do this to myself? I mean, it's like self-neglect, you know? I don't really want to get into what I believe because I feel like I'll get hate for it and I'm, I don't want to deal with that, okay? That's too much work. But I do think there's a certain point where it is called obesity for a reason because it's not healthy. It's not healthy to be obese. It was a whole learning experience though, to be honest. I learned that it really isn't that hard to gain weight in a short period of time because I literally gained so much weight, like 20 or 15 pounds within literally like a month and a half. It's so interesting because I learned how to reconstitute semaglutide myself and now terzepatide also. I buy them myself from basically a Canadian website company it's called arctic peptides i researched the hell out of where to get this stuff because i was terrified i mean you're literally putting something into your body is it called intravenously open please please thanks obviously i'm going to talk about the benefits and pros and cons of using semaglutide versus terzepatide but one thing i will say in this video is you don't feel sick with terzepatide. There's a reason it costs more. It doesn't give you that nausea. It just cuts off your cravings, your appetite. You literally just eat when your body needs food, like needs nutrition. I see it's a huge difference because I feel like in today's day, we have too much food, too much bad food for that matter. So it's so easy to gain weight. It's just absolutely ridiculous. The kind of ingredients that are in European products like ketchup or maple syrup and American products. It's absolutely crazy. Like maple syrup, now is the time, like, you know, maple syrup, maple syrupy stuff. Look at the Costco maple syrup that costs more. It's like the organic one. There's one ingredient, maple syrup. When you get the, it's not called Aunt Jemima anymore. It's that other syrup, which is obviously like GMO land. It has like 10 different ingredients. What are you guys doing out here? I don't understand. Oh my gosh, the clothes that didn't fit, fit me so much better just it's just a whole new world like i feel like me again and i'm so grateful if i was trying to lose weight for over a year and the stress like it just wasn't working out for me thank you guys so much for watching my video don't forget to like comment subscribe hit the bell so you know when i come out with my next video and i'll see you guys in my next video <laughs> Si quieres